Ladies and gentlemen, can I please have your attention? I've just been handed an urgent and horrifying news story. Aww. You know, my dad used to tell me, son, you can do anything you want to do in life. Just pick what you want to do and do it good. You can be a doctor, a lawyer, pilot. You can dig ditches for your life. You can be a bum. Just be the best bum possible. Well, I'm much a bum. The best one possible. You piece of shit. That's right. The mobile gambler. Uh, Lori's way. That's right. There she is back there. Lori's way. She uh, had a little fireside chat last night and uh, the topic of, you know who. That there guy there. The mobile gambler. Yeah. The topic of him came up and they were talking about what happened, what had what had happened was, but yeah, they were talking about that for a little bit, but, uh, the word was that, uh, yeah, he came back and somebody did spot his van or so they said, allegedly <laughs> his van was spotted at the casino. Oh, really? And uh, allegedly, there are some people that are not happy at all. And uh, they are, uh, let's just say, threatening some bodily harm if shit doesn't get straightened out. So, actually, I wanted to do the live stream because I want to talk about some guy here, like I said earlier. You wanted what? Talk about some guy that's... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, I can't wait. Oh, yeah. yeah, we're looking forward to this. <laughs> we're going to go sit at our fire. We're going to go sit okay. and enjoy. TMT. Yeah. His channel. The... Mobile Traveler. Yeah. <laughs> Randy. Randy. The dumbass. His name is What did he do? Lose his wallet again? Yes. No, somebody stole it this time. Oh. With over four thousand dollars in it. His he at doesn't least, have no four thousand dollars. Allegedly. It he doesn't him. have no four thousand dollars. People gave it to him so he can go to Phoenix to get what? solar stuff. No yeah. way. Yeah. And then somebody he supposedly or allegedly <laughs> like blind view says, allegedly. Somebody broke his window and broke in and, and stole all the money. So how's he yes, the mobile sca all scammer? The people back their money. He's not. He's not. What? You, what? Latest news is I heard some of those people are are threatening his life, or oh. not total life, but bodily harm and stuff like that. Is he still right over there? Yep, over in the spot. You can find it on the maps. And over four thousand dollars. Really, would a wallet fold with all those bills, even if there were hundreds and twenties? No. Yeah, and I guess he didn't even report it to the police. Because it didn't exist. Yeah. So, and why? Why didn't those people go to him right away and ask for a police report, or you know, go to the police themselves or something? Yeah. So. Yeah, it's not fishy in Denmark. Yeah, that's why nobody should trust that when guy. When did you go to Denmark? <laughs> When he lost his wallet for the umpteenth millionth oh. time, apparently. Oh, he's probably lying all the time. Yeah, there's so many times that he's his water pump or his because his people didn't know about it. starter or, or things in his van well, don't work, and he always gets somebody to pay for it. And be safe. But, you know, people don't have that kind know, of money. He doesn't really need his. And find a new group. Yeah. There you go. That about sums it up. Stay away from. The mobile traveler and here's the thing this young lady that happened to a year ago eight months ago and everything everybody knows about it everybody knows about it everybody knows that randy talks a lot of shit everybody knows 
that Randy scammed people. Everybody knows about his little trailer fire. Everybody now knows about this uh, 4K that allegedly went missing. Everybody knows this. Everybody's been knowing a whole lot of stuff about him and his character for a long time. Yet, yet we have people <clears throat> like uh, such as, let's see, RV Rebel Girl, Destination Open Road, Tater, and, and others. We've seen them hanging out at the spot talking about how good Randy is and what a nice guy he is. Come on over. Sure. He's awesome. These people are giving him praise. They are vouching for this scum. These are the kind of people that you're watching. This is Randy the Mobile Traveler. How you doing? Yeah, I went gambling, so what? If people are going to give me money, it's their own stupid fault. How many times have I lost my wallet and cried about it? Or when I have mechanical problems even though I told Joni I could fix her RV. If people sent me the money to get down to her in Arizona, what suckers? I've duped old ladies and even romanced them to get to their bank accounts. That's what I do. Even though I cook for everyone, I think they owe me for all I do. After all, I am a bum and the best bum I can be. I think the inhabitants here are getting up a posse to come after me, so I better get going. The mobile narcissist. It's about a person who uses mobile in their handle here on YouTube. That's all I'll say about that particular person, other than, yeah, he is a narcissist. You know, he uh, basically kicked his wife to the curb with 40 bucks and a uh, pillow and a blanket. Um, and then he's been stealing money from women right and left. The FBI's coming after him now. And women have been donating money to him. He does these uh, woe is me uh, um, chats, uh, live chats that are uh, basically e-begging, lying about his truck being broken down or to the degree that it's broken down. Um, I just wanted to say, look, if you've got anything to do with the mobile narcissist, just stay away from him, please. I mean, he's using you. He's abusing you. I don't even watch his channel anymore. He's so annoying. Uh, the woe is me crap has got to go. I would not recommend the mobile traveler to anybody because it will just bring you a lot of problems, concerns, and loss of money.